Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we have got this logic puzzle and we are supposed to fill out these green boxes such that if we add or divide, we are supposed to get 9, 135, 85 and 11. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing I am going to do. Let's label these boxes. I'm going to call this box lowercase a, this one lowercase b, this one lowercase c and this one lowercase d. And here's the very first thing we are going to do. We are going to deal with these mathematical operations, just the division one first. So therefore, let's focus on these vertical boxes. B divided by D equals to 85. And here I have just copied it down over here. And now let's focus on these horizontal boxes. C divided by D equals to 135. And here I have just copied it down. C divided by D equal to 135. Now let's go ahead and focus on this equation first. We are going to deal with this one. As we can see on the left hand side we have a fraction b divided by d equal to 85. I can make it a fraction on the right hand side as well by just putting 1 underneath. And now let's go ahead and do one thing. We are going to flip both sides over. That means put the reciprocal so this become d over b equal to 1 over 85 and now let's go ahead and solve for d so i'm going to multiply by b on both sides so this b and b is gone we got d equal to b divided by 85 all right now let's focus on this part this equation now and we can see that we have this fraction c over d on the left hand side let's make the fraction on the right hand side as well so i can put one underneath this 135 and now the next step we are going to do the same thing we are going to flip it over so this become d over c equal to 1 over 135 let's solve for d so that means i am going to multiply by c on both sides so this c and c they are gone so we got d equal to c divided by 135 all right and here's our next step let's go ahead and compare these two equations and we can see on the left hand side d is same so therefore we can equate the right hand side part of these equations so therefore i can write this one as b over 85 equal to c over 135 now let's go ahead and cross multiply we're going to crisscross so i can write this one as uh, 135 times b equal to 85 c and we can see that these numbers on both sides they are divisible by Five. let's go ahead and divide both sides by 5 so therefore we are going to have on the left hand side 27 b equal to 17 c just keep in your mind we got this really crucial equation so we finally got 27 b equal to 17 c let me go ahead and call this as an equation number one and here's our next step let's go ahead and add these two vertical boxes a plus c equals to 11 and here i have just copied down a plus c equal to 11 and moreover these two boxes a plus b equal to 9 and here i have just copied down a plus b equals to 9 
Let's go ahead and subtract the second equation from the first one. I'm going to change the sign negative a, negative b, negative 9. And now we can see that this a and negative a, this is gone. So we got c minus b equal to 11 minus 9 is 2. And now let's go ahead and multiply both sides of this equation by 17. I'm going to multiply 17 on this side and 17 on this side as well. Let's distribute this one. So that's going to give us 17c minus 17b equal to 34. And now we can see that 17c equal to 27b. Therefore, I can replace this 17c by 27b. So we got 27b minus 17b equal to 34. On the left hand side, 10b equal to 34. Let's divide both side by 10. We want to isolate b. So b turns out to be 3.4. So thus our B value turns out to be 3.4 as you can see over here. And as we can see that B is 3.4. So we know that A has got to be 5.6. If we add 5.6 plus 3.4, we indeed is going to get 9. And we figured out our A value 5.6. Then we can see that C has got to be 5.4 because if we add 5.6 plus 5.4, we are going to get 11. And here's our final step. Let's go ahead and calculate the value of D. And we know that this B divided by D equals to 85 from our previous step. We can write this equation as D equal to B over 85. And we know that the B value is 3.4. I am going to replace it over here. So therefore I can write D equal to 3.4 divided by 85 and now if we use a calculator our d value turns out to be 0 0.04 so that means d value is 0 0.04 now let's go ahead and check these numbers c divided by d equal to 135 and if we check use a calculator 5.4 divided by 0 0.04 indeed gives us 135. So thus our A value turns out to be 5.6, B 3.4, C 5.4 and D 0 0.04 and that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.